it actually looks like a really nice day. It's cold and rainy, like it just had this massive downpour, but it looks super pretty. But anyways, we're here for business, goodwill business. And also the um, police scanner thingy immediately went off as soon as I got, not went off, but it told me to protect my belongings, which it does every time, but it does to no one else, just to me. I don't know what that's about. But anyways, let's go in, see if we can find anything good in the wills. Um, also, last time I was here, I got eight copyrights. So that pretty much means prepare for music overlay hardcore because the music, I guess, at this one is like uncontrolled. It is absolutely blaring. I, I, I don't know. So I'm just giving you a heads up. But let's go in see what we can find. Okay, the color is a purple. Oh, they marked it down to 70. They used to print those at 100. Oh, tequila. Gazorbe's belt buckle. It's actually not a ton in the case. Mm, there's actually some purple back there. But it's kind of slim pickings. Alright, we'll head out to the other things. And see what we can find. The cover is purple. Purple is our color. I'm just gonna do a quick look because it's been like a week and a half since I've been here, so it's pretty newish. So I'm just gonna see if there's any new things. Mm, vintage. It is purple though. $6.99, but no brand. So we'll leave that on. Well, the Brighton is still here. It's really sad looking though, so. Oh, okay. Let's go look at shoes, and then I'm gonna come back to the bag section. Mm, no. Let's just do a quick little look. I did find Rafi's last time. Rafi's and Corral. Um, so yeah, I did find some really good shoes last time. So, you never know, you never, never know. Gotta look at all of the racks. Well, the music is just blaring. These are cute. I think they're just random brand. I saw these last time. Oh yeah, Treasure and Bond, those are 10. Yeah, those have been here a little while. Um, Dione, Mexico, eight. Eight dollars. Lane Bryant, these are half price, so 350, no four. Four on those. Ooh, I liked these last time, I think, too. They are 10 snake uh, print Sam Edelman's. 50% off day, though. Definitely would get those. We have some Sorel sandals for 10. What else do we have? Karen Scott, no thank you. 
Target. Nine West, ten dollars. Uh, Banana Republic, ten dollars. I probably would get those on half price day. Um, I sold a pair similar to this, but suede, like a suede brown, um, and it did pretty well, like thirty-ish, I think. So, okay, let's go look at some breakable things. And Klein, 10, it looks like we have, what in the world? Oh, we have some Doc Martens. They are 30, and it is blue, the color. Um, I don't think I would pay 30 for those, but 50% off day I would. Uh, from Ross, $6.99. Down the office aisle, one of my favorites. This like looks like Lily Pulitzer. Mm, maybe, maybe not. Uh, Two ninety nine on that one. What do we have up here? Half price. Mm. Oh, Thank you. Oh, it is Franklin Cove, USA. So that is four. Mm, that might be worth it. Might be worth it. A bunch of. Oh, they're raising their price. price. It's now eight dollars. They used to be like three. Raisin the price. Thing of stamps for three ninety nine. Oh, it's dark vintage. I'm not really interested in those. Case logic, $3.99. What are you? American National, $3.99. To the next aisle. What are you? Before we go. Mm, vintage. Uh, not sure the brand. Two ninety nine, but half price. It has been here like two months. Okay, let's pick that up. Let me do a quick look at the top here. Additional cashiers to the registers, please. Additional cashiers to the registers, please. Okay, let's go to the next aisle. Ooh, the music is uber loud today, so. So we're going to be doing a bunch of copyright covers. This 
this is interesting. Oh, jeez. Oh, we're caught. Oh, we are caught. Let's just put this back in. And it's like bumper cars here. Oh, it's a music box, Bombay, but they want 15, which is a bit excessive, if you ask me. This is kind of fun. Someone just made it. $4.99. Oh, I swear. Coming to Goodwill is like, like the retail is like bumper cars. There's no room to move. It's just unpleasant, unfortunately, unless it's just empty in here, which it usually isn't, to be honest. Okay, what else do we have? Oh, these are cute. Four ninety nine a piece. Let's look over here. Oh. Does your house make any of these numbers? Hmm? Some Holland clogs of uh, seven on that one. A little bit of art. Oh. This actually is interesting. Seven. It's like heavy, heavy resin. Mm, half bricks. Okay, let us move on. Move on to another aisle. What is this? It is $3.99. Oh, hello, there I am. Um, $2.99. $2.99. Oh, I was like, what is going on here? But it's a frog um, stopper thing. Anyways, it's $3.99. Just had a concerning moment there for a moment, but to drink to mind me. Sometimes it takes a minute to click what an item is. This looks like a, or it feels like a paperweight. One ninety nine. That's actually kind of cute. We have a little copper basket for three ninety nine. Oh, we've got like a. This was twenty five dollars. I don't know where, but it is four ninety nine here. Oh, we have some tins. I love a good tin. What do we have Quaker Quaker cornmeal three ninety nine. Oh, I like that one. Um, another Quaker one, 1983, $3.99. I'm not so excited about the Ritz one. But I do kind of love this one. I do kind of like it. I will look it up to double check if it is worth it to get. But I'm a sucker for a tin, I don't know what to tell you. Oh, I think this brand is good. $2.99. I think it is. I'll double check on that one too. Oh my lord, look at that duck. It's huge. Uh, what are you? Oh gosh, I'm breaking things. Bend awards and add specialists. $7.99. Oh, they tore the faceplate thingy, or the plate off. Some sort of um, first responder awards. Ooh, that's a big one. Oh, that one. Mm, a 
Okay, I think I'm, I'm prepared, prepared to move on. All right, hold on to your pants. Uh, I might look this one up just to double check, but I like this one more if I was to get one of one of uh, the two. But uh, I'll check that one too. So I'll be back. Okay, it's a really lightweight. Um, let's see what the else we have. This is kind of fun. Two ninety nine. If there was another one, I might be more excited, but that is cute. Probably do a Google image on that. How much is it? $2.99? Uh, maybe I'll get that. Maybe I shall also get that. Oh, I remember this. This was here last time. I thought they would have sold for more, but they don't. I don't know why I had in my head that Holiday Inn sells well vintage ashtrays, but oh my god, I love these. It's like the old fidget spinner. You just sit here and watch these. Uh, how much are these? $1.99. I love that. <laughs> I kind of just want it for myself. <laughs> oh, that is plastic. Kickerland, four ninety nine. Oh, I've seen these before. It's a magnet. Okay, what else do we have? Just one calorie, low cal cow. <laughs> That's fine. What does this say? Kurt Adler. $2.99. I'll double check on him. It seems like that might be decent. What is he? He has like a weight in him. He has $2.99. Kind of love him. Mm -hmm. Got a picture. Teleflora. What is this? Half price. $2.99. What the else do we have in here? What is this? Oh, it's a cookie press, right? For cookies? Uh, $3.99? Maybe? $4.99. That looks vintage. Half price on that. Mmm, seen him every time. Mm. Harry and David, six ninety-nine. Mm -mm -mm. Oh my. What in the world? Three ninety-nine. Trinket dish with hummingbirds, $3.99. What, is, what are you? Um, Target. Oops. $1.99. I think that's a dollar. Okay, let's look down here quick if there's anything on the lower shelves. Okay, 
I'm gonna come back and do the other side when it is free. So let us just keep going down here. And I will go back to that one. $4.99. This is obviously queer glass. Oh, I see these like all the time. $3.99. Okay. Oh, look at this cat. Andrea West Sigma, $4.99. and get the front part of the Christmas part. This is half price. Let it snow wreath. Um, four dollars. This goes in here. That's cute. That's cute. Um, okay. I got some... $4.99 Emily Violet Half price, so she is two Certificate of Authenticity. Hmm. Let's look into her. Do you like how I'm staffing this up? <laughs> I'm very precarious. <laughs> Don't worry. Okay, I'm gonna sneak around. I'll be right back. Okay, kids of the USA. That is 10. She has been here about a month, so someone probably would have snatched her up if she was worth something. Okay, please hold. Okay, let's get this other side of the little knickknackers. Oh my lord, look at this kid's feet. They are huge. Made in USA. Little Basset Hound. He's very cute. He's very scuffed up though. Uh, $4.99 on him. Oh, oof, this feels really light. $2.99. $7.99. Looks like, or feels like marble maybe? Like broke off. Yikes. Oh, her leg's in her. It's on her little platter. Ooh, that's too bad. Uh, $6.99. Platinum song tequila. $4.99. Ooh, this is a fun little base. Uh, $6.99. I feel I saw this last time and he's adorable. $2.99. How are you? Handcrafted ceramics made in Vietnam. $2.99. Get him. $1.99. Original China. Four ninety nine. What's up there? Four ninety nine. Oh, 
if he's still here. Let's give him a friend. Three ninety nine. We'll get her. Dollhouse Ceramics Lebanon, four ninety nine. Very cute. these last time too. Oh, maybe not. Danbury Mint, $4.99 a piece. Um, each of those. The color is blue. Oh, look at him. What is happening here? Oh, well he's half price. A dollar. Yeah, what's going on? That was terrifying. Okay, let's go down the mugs and cups aisle. These are fun. Kind of like a carnival glass. Are fun. Two ninety nine a piece, and then there's some martinis. Look at those gross ones. Um, also two ninety nine a piece. Ooh, these are fun. One ninety nine a piece. I might do a image, Google image on these. See if they're anything, anything worth. Getting I think I saw these last time too. $2.99 a piece. Uh, oh, $4.99. Oh, here's some more. Oh, they must have like came in a set, I'm guessing. Yeah, because they're. I mean, I'm just guessing. I'm just guessing. Bullet whiskey. Okay, I'm gonna do a screen grab on these and see if they are anything. And then I will be taking a peek on the opposite side. Okay, so these are Wedgwood. Uh, one of the Grecian prints, obviously. And they do pretty decent. Um, there's some posted four for $30. Um, but I can't get it at two apiece. Because if I got four, that would be $8. I don't know. I just think that's a little... I don't know, it's, it does not motivate me. Even though I love them and they look really pretty. Um, I probably am just going to leave them. I wish they would lot them up to sell them, but who am I? Who am I indeed? I don't know what those are, but those are only 50 cents. Okay, let's look at the mug section. See if there's anything just amazetastical over here. Kind of standing back and looking. My shoelaces are driving me crazy. Oh, this is a fun Starbucks tumbler. $4.99. No straw. Oh, Mariah's mug is still here. I wonder if her fella is. Mm, someone bought the fellas. She's left alone. But hey, that's great. I mean, it's great that someone bought the one mug because they are really cool mugs. Holtzgraf, $1.99 each. 
novel Korea 299. All right, let's go down the next aisle. Oh, I think I went down here. Yes, I did do a little peek and there wasn't anything like super amazing that I wanted. So I just did a quick little look in the dishes aisle for you. $4.99. Okay, let's go down the next. Butterfinger bubble. Mm, $6.99 for that. Oh, this is a big one. Libby, four ninety nine. dollars mm, This is a nice bowl. $6.99, but half off. Handcrafted in Portugal Pottery Barn, $14.99. Oneida <coughs> Vintage Fruit, $6.99, but that is half off. What are you? Gail Pittman, $3.99, half off on that one. Rachel Ray, $6.99. Okay, money's vintage. Made in USA. $1.99, maybe. Okay. I'm not sure what this aisle is, per se. It just kind of looks like a mishmash aisle. Mm. There's a bunch of these. Oh, these, I was expecting them to be um, plastic. <laughs> Teapots, pictures. This is a fun little teapot. Victoria's Garden, four ninety nine. Match salt and peppers. I don't know why I love salt and peppers so much. Additional cashiers to the registers, please. I just please. do. Additional cashiers to the registers, please. Look at these pears. Two ninety nine each. $2.99. He is a lone cow. Okay, what do we got up here? This looks fancy, but I don't make coffee, so I have no idea. Ego syrup warmer and dispenser. When were you made? That is interesting. Okie dokie. I'm going to meander. These are fun, New Orleans. $2.99 a piece, but those are cool. Okay. Let us 
move on. It's kind of like senses overload in here today. Kind of feeling, oh my gosh, look at how bare these shelves are. There is like nothing on them. Is it because they were like heavily shopped or what is happening? Like Johnson and Brothers. Do, do, do. Made in England. Royal Mail. $7.99. A very fancy bowl. Ooh, I have these. These are Pioneer Woman. $6.99. I don't think they make this pattern anymore. It might be popular, actually. Okay, let's go back down this way. I think I'm gonna go look at picture frames and then head over to the purses. $4.99. remember if these are good or not. Mm. I don't remember. I might have to look into that too. Okay, stay tuned. I'm going to be meandering. Vivian Flash. Uh, she's three ninety nine. Graphics, two ninety nine. I kind of like that one actually. We'll be friends until we are old and senile, and then we'll be new friends. Sounds like a plan to me. Tolan Beck. Oh, that looks spicy. Oh, certified authentic, three ninety nine. Does it say Dupai Button Jerry Karen Du Dupai? Should I Google image this? Spicy business? Maybe I shall. Oh, look at this really sad looking Garfield. Someone tried though. This is kind of fun. It is a signed Lori Corrigan. It was originally eight, selling for $2.99 here at the Whittle. cute for a little girl's room. There's three, they're five each. What is this? Marriage. Butterflies. Lamb, 19.97. 2.99. Okay, I'm gonna 
look up the spicy art. Uh, and then I will be heading over to purses. I might look up this one too. I'm curious about him. So I might look those up and then head over to uh, the purse section. What do we have over here before I go? I will be back. Okay, the uh, music is on another level. Um, oh, that's vintage, I'm pretty sure. Hmm, let me make it that. Okay. Why don't we just untangle that? Put that back. Oh, here's an eel skin coin purse. It's like a nice blue. Okay, let's see how much this is. Two ninety nine. I'll probably get that. Mm. I also found this uh, Demoni. I've never heard of it before, but it feels quality, so I looked it up, and it does look to be decent. So we'll get that one. Are you? Or $7.99. What is this? This is like a um, nylon. What is this? Fifteen minutes. Well, that old navy. Mm. What is this? Tommy Bahama. Ten. I didn't even know Tommy Bahama made bags. To be honest, is this leather? Release yourself. Let me see. Um, where's your tag? Hmm. Good question. It's gonna be high. It is 15. Mini mouse lounge fly. Mm, I wonder if the. Mm, it doesn't have its strap, its crossbody strap. There's like some on the floor. We are struggling over here. It's like the sack, maybe? It 
is Moda or Mira Moda. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> it's hard to read sometimes. I'm not going with that one. Who makes you? It is $12.99 and I'm not seeing like a brand on that one. Relic Miche? I think that's what someone said it's pronounced. I just kept saying niche. Now you just choose a name and go with it, I guess. Hmm. Okay, I think I'm about done. So I will be going elsewhere and doing a little recap. This looks vintage. Bath outdoor gear. It's $7.99. Hmm. Questionable. Alright. I'll be doing a recap and I need to look up that Tommy Bahama bag so I will be back. Okay. Here is what we are ending up with for uh, today. There's a little staining there but that's okay. Um, first is this eel skin vintage coin purse and there's like a coin purse in the coin purse. Um, $2.99 on that. So we're gonna get that. Uh, vintage Nike USA um, fanny pack. This is $7.99 but half price. So four on that. Um, a Tommy Bahama leather bag. This one is $10. These look to go for like $40 to $60. Um, so I am going to get that one. Next, a brand I haven't heard of before, Dimani. Um, these also look to do pretty good, and this one is only priced at $4.99, so um, that one's a score. Um, next are some vintage Coca-Cola little disposable or reusable cups, and these are only $1.99. So we shall get that. Next is a Franklin, I wonder if I can get that off, we'll see. Cove um, messenger shoulder bag extraordinaire. Um, $6.99 half price, so $3.50 on that. Next, a Kurt Adler little ornament. He is $2.99. I'm not sure if I'm going to be getting him um he does have a button missing and they don't look like they're exceptional um but yes we did give him a good look um next this is a, like a asian version of the weeble wobble which i kind of love i don't know why <laughs> um anyways that is 2.99 next is this little doll it comes with a certificate of authenticity emily violet little um doll she is also half price so two dollars on her next a vintage quaker oats tin i love tins i don't know what it is i just love tins um 3.99 on that one i did look up the other ones and they don't look to be as great so i left those and i just decided to keep this one and last is a le bouquin schmidt tin and this one is 2.99 like i said i love the tins i don't know what to tell you <laughs> um this needs a really good cleaning but I definitely think it's a good pickup for $3.50. Vintage Franklin Cove, Cove um, does really well. So I will be giving that a little scrub and it should be good to go. So we found some decent things today. It can't be a fill a cart all, all day, every day. And to be honest, I don't know if I could do a fill a cart every time I went thrifting just because 
I would probably drown in inventory. <laughs> so we'll take, we'll take the little bits, the little bits and bobs here and there. All right, if you could give this video a thumbs up, I would so appreciate it. It helps the algorithms and helps people find the videos. And thank you for putting up with the music overlays with the loud speakers. I appreciate that even more. Um, but yes, it tends to be a loud Goodwill, but they always have really decent stuff. So I will always want to stop by um, and bring you guys with. So I um, apologize for the music, but I do appreciate you all hanging in there. All right, until the next digging adventure, I'll see you later.